Gary and I are here at the Columbia Harbor House at the Magic Kingdom of Disney World. We always like to come upstairs. It's nice and quiet up here. There's so much seating and it's just it's just a nice way to relax. But we ended up getting the seafood trio. It comes with fish and chicken and shrimp and hush puppies and then on the side our choice we pick green beans i thought about extra hush puppies because their hush puppies here are phenomenal and then gary had to get this i'll probably have to try it but you guys know i'm allergic to chocolate so i'll probably only have just a little bit of it so the price oh and we got a sweet tea and we got a bottled water the Boston cream pie was $5.99. The trio sampler was $28.58 for two of them. The sweet tea $4.49 and the bottled water $3.75. Total is $45.35. So let me get a close up and personal of your food. You want to give it a test drive? Tell me what you think. Those are maybe some of my favorite hush puppies around at any of the parks. Crunchy, but it's easy crunch. So good, and it's got that corn in it. It's just like delicious and sweet. Mm -hmm. It looks like it must be a strip of chicken. Super tender, isn't it? Mm. I really like the coating on it. It's got a nice crunch. The shrimp, they kind of overbread it to make it look like it's a big shrimp. <laughs> and then when you bite into it, it'll be this little tiny thing. Let's yeah. see if I'm correct. That's hilarious to me. Is it good? Yeah, very good. This might make it better. I'm gonna try a piece of that fish. Mm. Oh yeah. We do have some tartar sauce. He just hasn't put his out yet. Is that pretty good? Mm. Yeah. Nice. Well, Is it flaky? No, not really too flaky. It's more like a thin, bit of it you know on there so when you bite on it it has a little bit of a crunch to it so. all right give a taste to your green beans it's not hot it's a little bit cool well it sat there for a while they were not on it today yeah yeah this is really, really cool we stood down there forever after we ordered to get our food yeah of course i'm going to start with the hush puppy because <laughs> that's one of my favorites they have a nice crisp crunch to the exterior, but they're super soft inside. It's got a nice sweet taste. Kind of a cornmeal exterior. The chicken has a nice batter to it. It really tastes super fresh. I'm sure it's not that fresh, but it tastes like it. Goodness, that is warm. Super tender. Yeah. Very juicy. We always love Columbia Harbor House. I'm not sure we've ever had a bad meal here. So here's the fish. It's flaky, but it seems kind of dry. Is it dry? Mm -hmm. A lot of dough on it. I mean, the, the breading is a little on the thick side. It's good. Almost sounded like a question. It's good. <laughs> I think my shrimp are buried underneath the soggy green beans green beans are ice cold shrimp very thick breading but it's good i'm gonna go ahead and try the green beans i'm a huge fan of green beans but these are literally ice cold to the touch And lastly, we're going to try the Boston cream pie. Last time I was here, the only thing they had for dessert was a Greek yogurt. That is not dessert. Give me a break. <laughs> so I'm glad to see that they actually have something again for dessert. Yes. Gary misses his peach cobbler. Is that what it was that yes, they had? Was. Peach cobbler. And that was always his favorite. And they haven't had that for a while. But, but anyhow, so we're going to try Boston cream pie. You want to go ahead and dig into that? Yeah, Remember, we're splitting. Yeah. Although it's not going to be a true split because I'm allergic to chocolate. Now that was all chocolate. You can see it how looks like it's got thick fudge on top. You can top. see how thick it is. I'm going to put that down there. Well, stick your spoon straight down. <laughs> and it's really stiff. 
So put it up here. Let's see. It's like a pudding kind of thing, and then there's cake, mm -hmm. and then of course the chocolate. Yeah. Looks like looks like maybe a layer of some sort of a sponge cake, and then the pudding kind of thing, another sponge cake layer, and then the chocolate on top. Yeah. And I'm gonna steal the cherry. She stole the cherry. <laughs> she stole the cherry. He gets the majority of the chocolate, so I'm gonna steal the cherry. Is it good? Yeah. Yeah. Well, tell me it's what it tastes over, like. Not over sweet or anything, like that. but I'm trying to figure it out because I don't know how many bites it's gonna take him to figure it out. <laughs> I, I think he's that, baking. I don't know what that is? I don't know. It's good. Let me find out. Yeah. She's a pro. So I think this on top is like a fudge, is what it feels like to me. It tastes like it too. Woo! <laughs> That's very chocolatey. Joe would love it. That is super chocolatey. I need to go easy on that part. Got a little bit of the pudding part. Is that? Yeah, the pudding, I think it's like a vanilla pudding, maybe. Mm -hmm. And then there's a sponge cake. It just kind of tastes like yellow cake, maybe. It's pretty good. Yeah. The chocolate part throws me off because I'm trying to not have the chocolate on there, and it's kind of impossible because there's a lot of chocolate here. I just don't want to be sick from my vacay. Yeah. I'm going to so try this part. Scrape off all the chocolate. <laughs> nope. This looks like a different type of chocolate up here on top. Okay. That's better. Ooh. That's maybe like a semi-sweet chocolate on top or something. That's super good. The other kind of chocolate seemed kind of grainy to me. Did it yeah, seem grainy bit. to you? Yeah. Usually grainy in food means it's old, but that doesn't make sense. I don't think anything at Disney sits around long enough to be old. Yeah, I can't afford it. <laughs> oh, it just means it's people eat everything, so it doesn't really sit around. Yeah. It's super good for five ninety nine for a dessert. We're splitting it. Yeah, you could probably split it three ways and still have plenty. Yeah, it's I very believe, rich. Believe Incredibly rich for the chocolate lover. You will love that. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> But for even somebody like myself, the rest of it is really good. Yeah. Wouldn't you say? I say so. All right. Columbia Harbor House here in Magic Kingdom, Walt Disney World. If you are new to this channel, please hit that like and subscribe and ring bell notification so you don't miss out on the latest and greatest. Also, please don't forget to check out some of our other great videos we have on the parks, the rides, resorts, resort rooms, Skyliner rides, day trips, car shows, outdoor pizza oven videos, Universal Studios, Islands of Adventure, and Disney World. Thank you so much for watching.